and run. So since I started my YouTube channel, which wasn't long ago, I have been so excited to do the what's on my iPhone tag video because I love seeing what other people have on their iPhones and what kind of apps they have and all that kind of thing. So I've been really sad to do that. And today I'm gonna to film it. The reason I didn't film it first up was because I had an iPhone 3GS. That's just like a normal old iPhone. And I, ooh, my foot's in shape. Yeah, <laughs> that was so weird. Um, yeah, so I just had a normal iPhone and recently, I think on Monday, I got a new iPhone 4 and I love it so much already and I know most people are like, oh my god, it's so different, blah blah blah, but I like it much more than my old iPhone, I don't know why, I just, I like it more, so yeah, so I was a bit hesitant to film with my old one, so I'm kind of glad that I waited and yeah, so let's get into it. Okay, for starters, as I mentioned in my introduction, I have an iPhone 4S, which is my new baby, and I love it, and the case I have on the back is just this um, black Chanel case, and I think it is so, so pretty, and it has just the white Chanel label, and I did get it off eBay, so it's like just a complete ripoff, but I think it's so nice, and so classy, and I'm quite in love with it, I really have to stop touching my hair, okay, starting now, but yeah, I will link where to get these in the down bar, but I think it's so pretty. It's just, I love it. And yeah, so as my wallpaper, I have this photo of Mary Kay. Oh, you can't really see it that well, but it's just um, Mary Kay and Ashley Olsen when they were little. And I love Mary Kay and Ashley Olsen so much. Like, they are my biggest fashion icons. I look up to them so much and I love them. So yeah, so that's just my wallpaper. And then you go into my phone, which I have a code on because people at school always take my phone and they're just like weird and I don't want them to touch it. So I put a code on it. Okay, so this is my home screen and it just looks like this. And the wallpaper is just this photo of heaps of sh Oh, went into my messages. But yeah, it's just photo with like heaps of shoes and I think it's kind of cool and I like it. And okay, on the bottom bar, I have my phone, music, contacts and messages. So they're the things I use most, oh my gosh, I have to stop touching stuff. Um, yeah, so they're the things I use most often. And then up here, I have the normal one, which everyone has. It's just Facebook and, oh god, I can't even do this right. <laughs> and yeah, I've got Facebook, which I use all the time. And another app that I'm absolutely 100% obsessed with is Instagram. And you go on and what it is, is it's got like people share their photos and stuff. And I probably shouldn't be showing you people I like follow those photos. But whatever. And yeah, so that's Instagram and I am obsessed obsessed with it and so I definitely recommend going and downloading Instagram if you don't have it and I will link my username in the bottom bar so go follow me I post so much stuff and then my first box which is I have all my apps and stuff organized in boxes I just find that easier to not easier but I find it more neat and I know I just think it looks better I just have all the normal stuff like my calculator, iTunes, Safari, all that kind of thing, photos, calendar, okay, oh, calendar, that is something I use heaps as well. And what it is, I just have like, so today's the 25th, which is Anzac Day, and if you don't know what Anzac Day is, which I'm pretty sure you would, but it's celebrated in Australia New Zealand, and yeah, it's 25th of April, I mean, I don't know what I said. Wow, it's so embarrassing. Um, but yeah, I have Anzac Day. I'm getting off my trail of thought so much, and I probably sound like the biggest idiot in this video. Not gonna lie, but that's okay. And um, yeah, so this morning I marched with my school. Every kind of town has a march, and just heaps of people, mainly schools, march down the main street of town. Everyone comes. And yeah, 
So I marched this morning and now all my family's at my house right now and we have chicken stew every end of the day so everyone is outside and I'm in here filming being antisocial. But oh well. So if it's a bit noisy, you know why. But yeah, so it's the 25th of April and I use my calendar for everything. Like if I've got something that I have to remember, I put it in my calendar on my phone. So I have like when I have to work, and yes I do work. Um I just have that all that in there, so I use that a bit. And yeah, so the next box is just productivity and it has um, you know, all maps and stuff like that. And then the next box is social. So the first app I have in this is Ringtone Maker, which I just make like ringtones with so you don't have the normal ones. Shazam, which is where you can um like if you hear a song and you don't know the name of it, you use Shazam and it comes up with what song it is. Which is quite handy. Then I have emoji, which allows you to send these little cute icons. Um, bump, it just you go like this to someone else's iPhone and it transfers photos wirelessly, it's pretty cool. And Tumblr, which I am also obsessed with and I am so in love with it. And I will link my URL in the bottom bar, so go follow me. Then I have um an app called Zombie Run Advance, which I heard about it on Tumblr and it what it is is it's a running app because I do lots of running and stuff and I love getting new apps running and what it is is it's supposed to like you run and it tells you a story for your earphones and zombies chase you and stuff and you have to speed up and but I can't figure out how to work it like it says you have to sign up or something but it doesn't let you sign up and I have no clue, no clue what to do with it, but I have it for when it starts working. I have Pose, which I found out about of Blair Fowler and GCR7, and to be honest, this can sound stu so stupid. I don't really get it. It's like, oh, I don't know. I don't really use it, but oh well, I might start using it soon. Then I just have the ANZ app because that's the bank I'm with. I have PickFrame, which is one of my, which is a really good app as well. Because what it does is, I was always wondering on Instagram, you can put like photos in there and it shows you like three photos. And I was like, oh my god, how do they do that? But you download this app, PickFrame, and it lets you do that. So yeah, I've got that. And then I have the Nike GPS, which is, it's simple, but it's my favorite app for running. And what it does is it calculates your runs and how long it takes and it just plays the music but as you're running it will say like you've done 1k, you've done 2k's, whatever. And you can also, because I run on the treadmill a lot um, at home, I just run for ages on the treadmill rather than running outside and I actually find that easier but yeah so it just, you can add your settings to it. And it calculates how far you've gone and it keeps a track of your runs. So, you see, I've, I um, had to reset my phone, so I've only done one run so far. I went 4.15 kilometers in 26 minutes, which I know wasn't very far, but whatever. I was tired. And it shows you how many calories you burnt and how far you go, like your average time per kilometer. So yeah, that's a really good app and I really, really recommend it if you're into running. I have Twitter here, which I don't use much, but because I don't really have any followers yet. But yeah, so go follow me. And I do really like Twitter. I had a personal account, but I made one for my YouTube channel. And yeah, so I do like Twitter, so go follow me. And yes, I do use Twitter. So I probably just repeat the same thing about five times there. Oh well. And I also have this mirror app. And it just oh, you can see my computer. And yeah, it's just a mirror. Whatever. I don't even know where I have it. But yeah, okay. So race people showing you the iPhones are like, oh my god, I don't use any games, blah blah blah. That's not me. I use lots of games. So see all these boxes? Filled with games. And I don't actually use all of them, but I do use some. And my favorite at the moment is Jetpack Joyride, which I love. And it's just fun to play when you're waiting around, which happens to me a lot at school. I know this is really bad, but I 
playing my phone a lot in class to be honest and what else do I like? I like Tetris, I play that a lot, Tail Blocks, that's good. I like all those um, Hotel Dash games as well, they're pretty good, so we'll cross them a leg. <laughs> And yeah, so those are my favorite games, and I do play games a lot, embarrassingly, but whatever. So yeah, they're the main apps and the stuff that I have on my phone. I know it's not really exciting, but oh well. I've been wanting to film this video for ages, and I'm so happy that I filmed it now. And I did stuff up a lot during this video, a bit tongue tied today. So yeah, whatever. Thank you for watching. Go follow everything I link in the down bar. And yeah, see you later.